guys, welcome to a new weekly vlog. If this is your very first time here, my name is Amaya, and we are starting off this vlog with a bang because it's homecoming day and the one music festival. So it's gonna be a day. <laughs> I am about to get dressed because I'm meeting Jaria at homecoming and then we're Ubering to the festival because I'm working with Hennessy on some content for the festival. So we're gonna go there, do a little content. Later on, my best friend Sierra is in town. So she is going to be meeting me at the festival this evening. It's gonna be a long day. We're about to go ahead and get dressed. I'm gonna go ahead and montage it out just because I'm I'm filming the content for Hennessy, like the outfit and everything. A little get ready with me. It is 10.33. I would love to be out of here by 11.10 at the latest so I can get there by noon. So we can at least have like a little bit of over an hour at homecoming before before we gotta go to the festival. So, girl, it's about to be a day. Are you ready? I'm probably gonna take my other camera today too. I have my Sony ZV-1. This is a ZV-E10. I got the ZV-E1, I think is what it's called, because it doesn't have a detachable lens. So, homecoming footage might be a little, <laughs> but I don't want them to take my camera because you can't have a detachable lens. So I'm just gonna keep it safe and I'm gonna use that camera, so enough talking let's get dressed so we can get up out of here Super excited. I'm waiting for my Uber. Let's see. It's the same guy. I said I didn't want him. See, they playing with me. I said I didn't want this guy. He's waiting too long. 11 minutes is way too long, bruh. <sighs> anyway, we're about to go. I am about to clear out my memory card real quick. And yeah. Let's go to homecoming. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, 10 out of 10, let's wait. I've been going big on the page out of state. Do research, check out the back of my place. I rep so heavy, your tech when I take. Still, I'm on that for the long run. That name that you got, say the right one. Don't try me, I rap like a python. Had enough of the talk, let me hustling. Got my name up, came up off of nothing. Jersey gon' hang up like Jane, cause I'm chosen. Need my necklace and wrist, it's it frozen. Getting bread out the game like I thought it. It don't make me no bigger to show it. The stack, cause I'm here for the trophy. Made it low and they cannot appeal. Show them nothing less than all the real. What you think it cost me out the deal? All I know is how I came in from the door. Since it touched down, all they want is more. Now I'm known to the world, I ain't trying to feel. Just run it up, run it up till I hear. My me. money grown, project grown, feel at home. Got the juice, many made. I'm calling game, in his face. Soon as slim, hit a J, renegade. My people long, won't be long till we all sitting on center stage. Get right off what I do. I know they getting tight off how I move. I still ain't did a write off on these juniors yet. I never even claimed that we was cool. Really, I was just playing it by the rules. Still moving like gang, got nothing to lose. But most of them won't know until I show. Everybody, who is a mojito? Comes back for another mojito. I'll take five mojitos. Same. Stay my back. Gotcha. Let me get the second mojito, and guess what happens? Five dollar difference. Grab your double mojito. Well, we got drink tickets, so I think we're fine. So I'm a, I'm a, I'm a. I don't need a double. I'm gonna get ready. Don't leave with the money. What you want? We should have lived with that. Leave with the free. Till I hit a meal. Till I hit a meal. Till I hit a meal. Just run it up, run it up. Till I hit a meal. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yeah, 10 out of 10, let's wait. I've been going big on the page out of state. Do research, check out the back of my place. I rep so heavy, your tech when I take. Still, I'm on that for the long run. That name that you got, say the right one. Don't try me, I rap like a python. Had enough of the talk, let me hustling. Got my name up, came up off of nothing. Jersey gon' hang up like Jane, cause I'm chosen. Need my necklace and wrist, it's it frozen. Getting bread out the game like I thought it. It don't make me no bigger to show it. The stack, cause I'm here for the trophy. Made it low and they cannot appeal. Show them nothing less than all the real. What you think it cost me out the deal? All I know is how I came in from the door. Since it touched down, all they want is more. Now I'm known to the world, I ain't trying to feel. Just run it up, run it up till I hear. My me. money grown, project grown, feel at home. Got the juice, many made. I'm calling game, in his face. Soon as slim, hit a J, renegade. My people long, won't be long till we all sitting on center stage. Get right off what I do. I know they getting tight off how I move. I still ain't did a write off on these juniors yet. I never even claimed that we was cool. Really, I was just playing it by the rules. Still moving like gang. Hey y'all, happy Sunday. So it's 
to. And we are at the One Music Fest. Um, we are switching out sisters today. We had Jaria with us yesterday and we'll be with Jazz today. Yeah. Excuse me? Yes, I'm working with Hennessy. Okay, my bad y'all. They thought I was staff. Well, I am kind of staff, but not really. <laughs> so we're gonna head over to Hennessy, but I'm about to meet up with uh, Jazz first. So I'm probably gonna help her get some content because she's working with Febreze here. So yeah. Hey baby. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, we know. Last year, short hair looks so good. I love it so much. It's so good. So we literally just got here. I just got here. Yeah, I don't have to be on site until like 20 minutes. Okay. I think for me, I'm done with like all my deliverables. I just did my story, so I just got to show face. You just here for vibes. Should you go to Hennessy first and then just wait for me? We can. Yeah, let's go. You said you want a bad one. Well, baby, I'm as bad as they come. Said you wanna have one. Yeah, yeah. You with the hottest under the sun. But be careful what you wish for. Make you eat your words. If I'm more than what you bargain for. Fun to flirt, but promise to deliver. Much is required. Cause look at what I'm giving you. You ain't really ready for real. Saturday and we are about to go and find us an outfit so the black girl digital awards is tomorrow and we ain't got nothing to wear we got this black dress from Fashion Nova but girl it was weird the feathers on it are really weirdly placed and so I needed something else so we are at Thips Plaza and we are about to go and get us a dress we're gonna go into house of cb and see what they got for us after this um like i said the awards is tomorrow but but they have like a whole weekend plan so we're gonna go to um the event that they have today which is kind of like panels and more informational stuff for influencers we're about to run in here go get something to wear and let's hope and pray that we have some success the dress i have on is from fashion nova i actually been filming another video for you guys you'll see that next sunday but um Anyway, that's why we didn't like get dressed and stuff together because we did it in that video. I'm low-key filming two different videos at once right now. It's fine. So, let's go. Okay, so House of ZB has some cute options. Not a lot of to-die-for options, but they had enough. So, we got four different dresses. Let's go ahead and try them on and see what we're thinking. So, this first dress was green. You know, it's already winning. <laughs> it actually was a little bit more brighter or like vibrant than what you see here. It's a little washed out, but it was a beautiful dress, but I really wanted a higher neckline. So we tried something else. This one was a mint green and y'all, I loved this on me. It was just so short. I kind of wanted it to be like a midi dress. That would have been better, but it still gave, especially with the hair. I love a tall like neckline on me with the short hair. So that's another reason why we chose this dress, but this was like a cream colored dress and it gave more casual. Y'all know this is something I would wear like on a regular basis. It's a little short, I would want a little longer, but this is cute, but it's not giving award show. The next one was similar to the mint dress, but obviously it's a deeper royal blue and it's a maxi dress loved it but this was not the one so we did pick one out and yeah let's see what we wear tomorrow okay y'all so now we are at this event uh for black influencer weekend we're just gonna go here and meet up with unique and see what they're talking about i don't really know what to expect but i think today is more of like an educational panels like i said earlier we're gonna go in here and see what's up i need to pull my ticket out though so i can make sure i can get in Baby, I am all over the place today. Thank you. Thank you. Hi. Welcome. Hello. What's your name? Maya Galore. Hi. I'm sure her case. Oh my God. She's so beautiful. Thank you. Uh, Maya, M A Y A Galore. Yeah. What? 
Were you at the um, Cascade YouTube HBC? I was. I knew I was yes. there. <laughs> Love the dress. Thank like, you. Thanks. Thank you so much. My first time wearing this dress. Really? I've been itching to wear it. I was like, today's it's perfect. It's in the weather. Calm. Yeah, the weather is perfect. The sleeves, the collar, everything. Okay. Thank you. Okay. All right. So okay. you can take the stairs up. It's all the installations. Probably if you want to like vlog. Snapchat's on, on, on deck right in here on stage. Your presentation's going on. And after okay. that is like um, Instagram and behind the scenes stories and tips. Okay, nice. YouTube is up there. Okay, perfect. Amanda and Haley from the Creator Collective, they're up there. Oh, nice. Okay. And then you can go through to the sound stage on the right. Sounds good. Thank you. about to get ready for the awards. Amira's in here for moral support because I need her to help me, well, moral and physical support. I need her to help me zip me up. Dior, stop! <laughs> Dior, no! No, no, no! Can y'all guess which which dress we got? You probably already know because of the thumbnail or something, but we got the mint green dress. It's so pretty, I'm so excited to wear it. I felt the best in this one from all the choices that we tried on yesterday. I love this one down, baby. I love it down. So we're about to get dressed. I wanted to make some time to get to like H&M and get maybe some different earrings and stuff. I feel like I'm just gonna have to wear anything that I already, something that I already have. I'm a little annoyed by that, but it's okay. Just dress up the dress. So I'm gonna turn this light off and see if the color payoff of this dress is actually better. Cause it's hard to actually see. I'm gonna keep that light off. Um, it's hard to actually see the color of this dress. It's a little darker than what it looks like for you guys on the camera. Working, working the dress up. No Dior, no Dior. Dior keeps just trying to, um, ugh. Dior keeps trying to get the dress. She likes the sleeves. No. Okay. All right, can you come help mommy? King is too, look at my titties. I gotta keep my titties like up. It fit yesterday, so just it fit yesterday. yesterday. You got this. Yeah, see the clip. Man, I love this dress so much. But also they had me try on the one in store that everybody tries on. This one has a little bit less give, you know? Mm -hmm. You don't have to be sighing and taking deep breaths. Oh, not, not like that. I appreciate that, Amira. Okay, let me suck my back in. Does that help? Yeah. Not like that. I don't appreciate <laughs> that. Not like that. <laughs> That part's not coming. Oh, I'm saying. Here, I'll try. Pull it down and then back up. Yeah, there we go. Thank you, baby. Isn't this pretty? That is beautiful. Oh, can I suck in? Is the question. Oh, can you breathe? I can breathe. Okay, you're good. I'm okay. We're gonna make it. Ah, oh, these titties though. Okay. So I don't know how to do this though with the dress on. Let me. I'm gonna need your help. I need you to unzip me. Not all the way, but like at the top. Thank you for your support. Thank you for your service. Dear daughter of mine. So cute. Okay. Is there a problem? Okay. All right. Uh, a little more. <laughs> a little more. He said, is there a problem? A little more. Okay. Oh, that, that, it, more. Okay. I could wear an actual bra. You should wear a bra. Maybe. No. I don't want to wear. Mommy. I mean, uh, I didn't appreciate that tone. What? And not like that. I mean, like, just Mommy. to make things e easier. It's not going to make it easier. Oh, freedom. I just, but I don't want them to fall throughout the night. But I like, I like. Should have got me some booby tape. I do have this tape. Let's see if this works. Maybe it'll be better. Okay, y'all, so we got the dress on. I think it's okay. I feel like the breasts look okay. I just really didn't want to deal with, like, rolls in the back. Um, I'm thinking about wearing these earrings from Shein that I love because I feel like they lend themselves to the artsy vibe. Oh, I need a back. Artsy vibe of the dress, you know? So other options are these. 
but I think that's too much. I don't know. I don't like those. These leaf ones, but I feel like that's too much detail with the sleeves. So I, I think I'm gonna go ahead and leave it with this. Um, I really like these earrings and I think that it lends itself to the style. So this should be tight enough to keep them up, but they don't have a lot of shape. Okay, y'all. So we had an emergency. I had to run to CVS and get some boob tape because it was just not working out and the problem is solved. I'm also debating if I wanna do like an inner corner of like a teal, you know, mint green type of color, but I like it. I think my issue is that yesterday it fit a lot better and I think it was because it was the try on version of the dress versus the brand new dress that's super tight. But regardless, I think with the boot tape, I feel a lot more comfortable, but it is a little tight. I'm a little stuffed. I don't, you know, feel super comfortable, but it's still very cute. I still love the dress. Um, now I'm running a little bit late, so I hate to have to cut the get ready with me short, but we gotta do it because girl, I got to get up out of here. Okay y'all, so a couple of finishing touches before we head out. I did go ahead and add a little bit of the mint green in the inner corners and we changed out the earrings and Mira said these were probably better um, with the style of the dress. And we are gonna have to go with like our black and gold accessories. But I feel like that makes it a little bit more, you know, formal. It's not ideal. This didn't come together the way I wanted it to, but it's okay. I still love the dress. I think it's a showstopper and we're gonna be fine. It's fine. It's fine. Usually I don't post. Usually I don't post, but I want the world to know. Time to pull a drop top out. Summer nights, it's a vibe, yeah. We've been keeping it in the house. Netflix and chilling, I GDM in, yeah. Didn't wanna share my love till I found someone. Speech. I did not think, um, I've been doing this for so long. Like, this is year 12. I'm literally celebrating my 12th year. And it's so easy to feel like we just have to follow a trend or do something because everyone's doing it. Just be you, that's how you win. And I am truly a testament to that. Thank you to my husband, Cam. I don't post, but I want the world to know. I'm a good catch, but I never let him catch me. No, I never let him play me. Wild thing, try to tame me. But you got my mood on sunshine. Let's take a trip. Souls on big smile. Let's get this lake. Stars are in the night. I'm supposed to lay with me in the moonlight. I want to be bold with it. Don't care what we told about it. Wow, baby, got a hold on it. Love on for tonight. They'll be calling us gold. No election day so we are about to get ready to go and uh, vote so we're about to throw on some clothes it's very chill today i don't have on no makeup so we're about to just throw some clothes on i know exactly what i'm about to put on because i want to look like a powerful woman today so we're gonna do a blazer i wanted to keep it more casual so i'm gonna do like this white um crop top with my jeans real quick and then I'm gonna do um, this structured blazer on top that I got from H&M. I also think I might put on a hat too cause I don't feel like putting a lot of heat on my hair today. Cause later on, I think I'm just gonna go to the grocery store and come back home. 
Um, so I'm trying to pick and choose when I put so much heat on my hair. Yeah, I don't want to, I don't want to put heat on my hair every single day. So we're not going to do that today. This is the blazer. It is from H&M. It says H&M edition on it. Yeah, very structured, very cute. Giving election day. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and take this off real quick. Pop on our jewelry, get us a fragrance so we can get up out of here. I want my ear cuff and these earrings which are also from H&M, I believe. Ouch. Yeah, also from H&M. I hope the lines ain't crazy long this morning. I am really hoping and praying the lines are not crazy long. Y'all, I cannot believe it's November. Where did the year go? This is crazy. Like, where did it go? <laughs> Thanksgiving is in a few weeks. My family is coming. I told y'all I'm hosting Thanksgiving, so I'm kind of excited. After that, it's Christmas. So, I've already started thinking about gifts. Amira wrote her Christmas list the other day, child. <laughs> We're about to put on this um, fragrance from Way. I feel like their scents are perfect for every day. And thank you so much to Way for sponsoring today's vloggy vlog. But y'all, as we're starting to think about gifting, Way is making it easier to give way better gifts this year. If you are unfamiliar with Way, it is the first socially connected hair brand and they like to ask you what you want versus telling you what you need and it was created by Jen Atkin. I feel like their hair and body products is the perfect gift for this year because I feel like now is the time for us to start thinking about where we're going to get people which is insane. One of the things that I love the most about Way products is how they smell, y'all. All of their body products, their fragrances, their hair and body mist, their body products, their hair products, they all smell for me, that's one of the best things about Way, but also I feel like my hair also feels really soft after I'm using Way products. So this is their, I'm just using it, didn't show y'all. This is their hair oil. Um, my hair is a little dry, a little dry this morning. And this oil helps to get rid of frizz and lock in split ends too. This also works as a heat protectant because y'all, Y'all know your girl been busy the past three weeks. Just so many events, so many things to do. And I need something to make sure that my hair is, like I just said, protected from the heat. Because I'm trying not to put heat on my hair all the time. But when I do, I need to be protected. It also is packed with nutrients, absorbs quickly. It, it keeps color from fading and it revives damaged hair super easily. Y'all also know I love their detox shampoo because especially back when I was having my bun and I was using so much gel, child, it helped to clean all that out. My hair used to be filthy after two to three days. The way hair and body products are perfect to customize your own routine, but then also personalize a gift for everybody on your list. So I want you guys to get on your way to save for the holiday. Go to T H E O U A I dot com slash Maya Galore for 15% off site wide. That's T H E O U A I dot com slash Maya Galore for 15% off. So, of course, we need the hair moisturized, but baby, we sure hope to put this hat on. <laughs> I'm trying to not just let my hair be dry and brittle, even if I am wearing a hat, which usually these days I don't wear hats because the short hair just gives. Okay, it just gives. And I feel like the hat takes, it don't take away. I like how the hat looks with the short hair. But anyway, child, we are about to head out. I need a necklace. I'm gonna go grab a necklace real quick. And let's go vote. <laughs> Your girl just voted. So I am, is this gonna stick? Yeah, that sticks. I'm about to head to the grocery store. But we got out, we voted. It is election day. It is eight. 53 in the morning so almost teared up looking at the ballot <laughs> i'm excited i feel like it's gonna be a very good day i'm anticipating the best outcome i'm about to head to the grocery store because i still have not gotten any groceries into my house like i keep saying it's been a crazy few weeks and my baby needs food so i'm about to go and get us some food some healthier things because we've been eating horribly so i'm gonna do that and then more than likely i'm gonna see y'all later on tonight for election night and we're gonna hope and we're gonna pray for the best in the crowd, in the club, at the bar, yeah, what's up? I saw you cross the room, yeah, glowing in the moonlight. I don't know where you've been, but I'm glad that you're here. Gonna take you by the hand and lead you to the dance floor. Girl, it's our time, just you and I. Don't run, don't hide. Now, 
I am in tears right now. I just got done sobbing. Y'all, I went ahead and went to sleep last night. I couldn't do I couldn't do it no more. Dior! I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it anymore. And then woke up to obviously what we all woke up to, which is what I was expecting because of the reason I went to bed last night. I just started crying. I didn't even, I've, I've been upset and disappointed all morning. I just, <laughs> number one, and I'm not going to make this too long. I don't talk about a lot of political stuff. It's not really political at this point. It's really just about hatred and, and racism and sexism. It's really what it's about. Um, I don't talk about a lot of politics and stuff like that on my channel. It makes you uncomfortable to live in this country because what? Number one, not only should the race have not been been close at all, I thought she was gonna win by a land slide. Because look at this man, look at what he's done. Look at what he has said. He has incited riots. He has sold secrets. He's a felon. He's got impeached twice. He has temper tantrums. Look at what happened with the last election. And y'all voted this man in? Again? It says so much about this country because it's giving you just didn't want a black woman in office because she's qualified, she's educated, she's prepped this. She has gone through the line to make it to this point. It makes sense. She values the rights of Americans. Like she, it's mind boggling. And I just started literally sobbing at the door because are you kidding me? It was not a competition. It's not a competition. It's ridiculous that he got in in the first place, but then you're going to vote him in again? And my feelings are hurt this morning. I'm upset. I'm about to go and get me a feel-good matcha because I just I need something to make me feel better. And I have multiple pieces of sponsor content due today. And when I do today, one of them I have to work on is due tomorrow. And then I got another one due today, uh, the one for this video that you guys have already seen. I need to get that edited and turned in. But I am, hi Dior. 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 <laughs> I am, um, I am very, Dior, uh, right? Can you get your booty out my face? I'm very, very, very upset and disappointed this morning. Um, I tell you one thing. Who I'm about to cry again. I'll tell you one thing. What a time to be celibate. Cause baby, if I wasn't busting it open before, I definitely ain't doing it now. Because you ain't about to put my life at risk. Absolutely not.
Yeah. Don't mind Dior. She's on our trip to Starbucks, but she's crying. Give us Okay, I know, I know. Y'all, I don't know. Well, Amira and I have come to the conclusion that we were emotionally drained. From the moment, the last moment y'all saw me sit down and eat my food and turn on the office, we've been asleep ever since. That was not the plan. Me, her, and Dior was knocked out on the couch. That was at around 10.30. It's 2.30. My plan was to take Amira with me to the mall because I needed some, well, I wanted to buy some shoes and a bag for the event we have tonight. Couldn't do it. We were knocked out. And me and Amir was like, what is wrong with us? Why are we sleeping like this? And we came to the conclusion that it must be just emotional drainage. Because needless to say, y'all, y'all haven't seen me since Wednesday because I, I had nothing in me. Like, I still haven't posted yet because I just feel weird posting very lighthearted, like, makeup tutorials and, you know, get ready with me and stuff with everything with the election. But I've done nothing. Well, that's not true. The deliverables were still due this week. I've been very busy doing like sponsored content that was due. Come on, Dior. Here, hold the dog, please. Yeah, Dior, she's just a baby while she about to start crying again. Here it is. <laughs> I'm her mother. But yeah, y'all, I've been working this week. Um, I had to take a day off on Wednesday and then they let me like delay some some submission dates. But yeah, I have not been vlogging or anything like that, so. Hi, can I please get three of the sausage, cheddar, and egg sandwiches? Oh. What kind of matcha do you want? You want to put a uh, yeah. cold one? Yeah. Can I get a grande sized iced matcha latte? Grande iced matcha latte? Yes. Can I get that with oat milk, two pumps of vanilla, and light ice? Thank you. Here, take the doggy. Oh, Thank big you, water. You're welcome, my love. You're fine. Anyway, y'all, I didn't want to wear the same shoes that I've been wearing, y'all. If you notice, I always wear my um, Tom Fords. Every time I have something to do, I wanted to go get some different shoes. I really only wear them because they're like the only option I have, in my opinion. If you notice, I ain't got a bunch of shoes. So I wanted to go get some gold shoes and a gold bag, but it's going to be what it is tonight. We're going to get ready to get them. And I wanted to, I wanted to vlog all day because I feel like I barely vlogged this week. So I was going to have y'all with me all day, but then your girl was knocked out. Honey, sorry, you can't come to me right now. We're going to park. It's how she acts every time I bring her with me to a drop. She mm. just left her at home. No, we shouldn't have. Yes, we should have. Okay, so. Dior! Oh my goodness! Yo! Okay, we're about to park. And you can give her small pieces of egg. Here for some. I'll see y'all when I get home. Hey y'all, so I just got done taking a shower. Obviously we're back from Starbucks and we are getting ready to go to an event. LYS is having an event tonight, their annual Friendsgiving event. They had it last year and I don't know where I was, but I couldn't make it. So I'm excited to make it this year. It is formal and fall colors. So I'm excited. I bought a dress on Fashion Nova this week. And y'all know Fashion Nova has like one day shipping. So that worked out perfectly. So we're going to get dressed here in a moment after we do this makeup. And I'm also filming this for like a cute little get ready with me for tomorrow. Um, and more than likely my voiceover. Because we're going to do a voiceover just about everything that has happened this week girl like i told you guys in the car i just have not gotten to the point where i feel like i could you know just start back posting my regular content um so hopefully this video will be a good middleman for me i think what it is is i gotta say something like i can't i don't feel like i can just go back to normal without like even though if you follow me on instagram i did put some things on my story on wednesday obviously because i was upset and hurt and all the things but i started to notice my reaction being different from some of the other black women in my life and we're all different obviously some of us took it extremely hard some of us took it hard but don't necessarily show it emotionally some of us just felt super empowered which is okay all of these feelings are okay but me personally y'all know I am a very emotional person any type of emotion that I'm experiencing it comes out in tears so I was a wreck on Wednesday I was a wreck after you know just pretty much saying how I felt about it I wanted to put the word out there for black women 
that it's okay however you are reacting to this. Cause though this should hurt for people in general, American humanity in general, really hard for women and especially hard for African-American women. So the post, matter of fact, I'll just put the post right here so y'all can read what I posted. That way I'm not, you know, misinterpreting my words and I am able to, you know, express to you guys what that message was. I wanted us all to know that it was okay because I started feeling like, okay, well, should I not be responding like this? Like, is it okay that I'm responding like this? And, you know, obviously it is. But I took it really hard. Like I cried Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Today was the first. Matter of fact, I did cry a little bit today just because I was on TikTok and I saw a post that made, brought me to tears. I took it really hard, but I found myself feeling like, you know, why am I still crying? Like, why am I still going through these emotions? And it is that serious. I felt like I needed that encouragement to know that my reaction was okay. So I put that on my Instagram just so any other woman that could have been feeling that way, I wanted her to feel you know, normal, like you're okay, sis. This is what's happening. This is very real. And that you're not alone. However you choose to respond, whether you feel bad for not showing emotion or whether you feel bad for, you know, being like me and crying for days. <laughs> And taking a day off of work. I told y'all Wednesday, I had to take off work. Um, I had content due on Thursday that I was gonna work on, on like actually film on Wednesday. And I told my managers this week, I was like, if I was had to edit, I think I would have been okay. But the fact that I had to be in, in the camera, smiling in the camera, I just didn't feel like smiling. So I took Wednesday off and then I got back to work on Thursday. And I'm not gonna talk about this too, 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 too much y'all, but this is what's happening in the world. I know a lot of women follow me that are not American, that do not live here, but I'm sure you guys see what is going on. And it's hard, it's a tough pill for us to swallow. But especially women of color or black women because we teach our daughters, we, in this country, we have to teach our daughters. It's that quote from Scandal where her father told her, you have to be 10 times better than them in order to get half of what they got. And this election outcome was literally the manifestation of that statement. <laughs> Cause are you kidding me? <laughs> like, are you kidding me? To have a woman of color, a black woman, who is overqualified for this position. This is the perfect position for you. Now I understand people's concerns with her and all that, that's one thing. But if we're looking at the policies and we're looking at the United States of America and protecting the people and having human rights and just basic things like that, and then also experience being a politician, understanding like she has experience in all three branches of government. But <laughs> somehow she lost to a felon. She lost to someone who is spewing hate and incites riots, wants to kick out people who have found safety and solace here in America. So that's why for as a black woman, this week has been tough because it just showed the true color of this country and that's tough. And us who have daughters, especially black daughters, having to sit back and explain this to our children, it's not fun. The conversation I had with Amir about this situation was not fun. And I must say, I spazzed out a little bit. I couldn't control myself. <laughs> I just know that there's so many women that follow me that are not American. So I just wanted to throw out kind of what that emotion is all about. You know what I'm saying? Just in case someone doesn't completely understand it. And we're not even getting on the sexism of it all. <laughs> like, are you kidding me? Why is it that the one time that he ran against a man, he lost, but the two times he ran against a woman, he won? Please make it make sense to me. When women that were way more qualified than him. He wasn't even a politician in 2016. I'm gonna let this rest. And we're gonna talk about something else here. <laughs> but there's no way I was gonna hop on here and just act like nothing happened. Obviously, y'all went through it with me a couple days ago a little bit. I'll set my two cents. Y'all know where I stand. <laughs> I am part of the 93% of black women who voted for black women and for people and for humanity. And I know there's gonna be a lot of people like, um, well, what about God? Cause you know, there's a lot of Christians who support the red agenda. <laughs> Baby, I didn't realize that God was okay with judgment and thinking that you're so much better than a group of people that they don't deserve human rights. That is my Christian point of view. Cause last time I checked, judgment was in the hands of the Lord. And last time I checked, he loves us all the same. Anyway, child, 
I've been feeling better these last couple of days and I'm excited to go to this event. I'm a little upset that I was unable to go and get um, the shoes that I wanted y'all, but it's okay. Like I said, y'all know this, I'll be wearing my little Tom Ford's padlocks everywhere. And really, I have some other shoes, but I ain't a lot of y'all. Financially, this has not been my year. <laughs> this has not been my year, especially since the divorce, which we're gonna be having some very real conversations about that next week so make sure you guys tune in for that but being in that relationship plus this year for me has not been great financially so if you notice your girl has not been shopping like that especially not buying very expensive stuff <laughs> one thing about the influencer industry is it does have ebbs and flows you know sometimes you have a really great year sometimes you won't have a really great year and that's why it's also imperative to make sure you're saving your money and making sure that you have everything that you need to keep up your lifestyle because there's no guarantee that money and income will be consistent and i'm really grateful that i've done that let's just say that <laughs> but times are changing now and i'm grateful for that but anyway child it has not been a thriving type of year for me um last couple years actually so yeah that's why your girl ain't got that many options when it comes to shoes <laughs> but we gonna figure it out mostly because i'm not trying i'm not saying i'm broke i'm not saying that i'm broke what i'm saying is i try to make smart decisions about my money and i know that my cost of living changed drastically when i moved to atlanta i kind of had it match you know the kind of money i was making so it takes a little bit more <laughs> to pay these bills, you know, than it did when I lived in St. Louis. There's a lot of other things that, you know, contributed to that, but I'm gonna keep it real with y'all all the time. I don't know if I wanna do like a eyeshadow look today. Either way, I'm probably gonna turn off my phone camera if I do that. I just got out of the shower and now I'm sweating bullets. I always start sweating when I'm talking about something that means something to me. Always, or meetings. <laughs> Oh wait, I'm gonna have to take another little wash up real quick before we get dressed. My favorite brush, brush, my favorite blush, which is this moon brush from Benefit. Obviously she's been through a lot. <laughs> that just shows how much I love her. She has been well loved. This is just the prettiest blush ever because it has like a shimmer to it. Also y'all, I forgot to tell y'all, I burned my hair off yesterday. I don't know if y'all can tell, but my hair is fried right here. The flat iron I was using was a pretty cheap flat iron and it did not have regulation, heat regulation, but I think it got up to like 350 or something. It broke on me. So I went to Beauty Supply and I got myself um, another one and didn't even recognize that it didn't have heat regulation. Girl brought the thing home. I was working, filming stuff uh, right here for a brand. My girl took my, took my um, sideburn right off right clean off i was so mad because it's my good side too you know what i'm saying and i like having a real long sideburn i already felt like i cut it too short when i cut my hair so um i was not happy about that but i went on amazon and i bought a different one so we're gonna style the hair here in a minute more than likely i'm gonna go ahead and do my little my little curls going in the opposite direction again because that is my style my favorite really my favorite type of look to do for events and stuff I just love it. I think it's pretty. And if you blend it right, baby, it just looks so creamy and pretty. I all, in the corner, I always go in with bronzer just because it brings in the rest of the bronzer on the face instead of using like a shadow. But I'll go into a mixture of this one and this one. And I just pat it on there. And then in the inner corner, I pat while also kind of like trying to blend the edges and not take that too, too far. Yeah, no, we about to do our wing. That's what I'm most comfortable in and I got over finally trying to not do it because it's my look and I'm okay with that. So I always use this black eyeshadow in this palette by Makeup by Mario and just wing it out with my brush. I mostly do it this way because of my lashes. When you have these false lashes, you're not supposed to use like a liquid liner. But also to me, the liquid liner just gives a little bit harsher than like the black shadow. The black shadow comes across a little bit softer. My face is starting to sweat. Oh, I gotta do something about that. The event tonight is a seated dinner. They have like a little cocktail hour and then it's a seated dinner. Sprayed with some all nighter. Dry down while I'm fan is downstairs. So I hope this little talk also made up for some time on the vlog channel. I <laughs> when I edit tomorrow, I mean tonight and in the morning, I don't know what I'm gonna walk into child right now. I don't feel like I got barely no footage. But we gotta make the best of it. This vlog is two weeks long. 
because I think the first thing in this vlog is me being at the um at homecoming and the uh fest which was two weeks ago <laughs> but it's fine it's fine also hit it with a little bit of highlighter it's been so long since I've done like a real good like matte face girl that would have hit tonight but it's okay I'm loving this lifter liner from Maybelline I use the deepest one. I think it's called Cross the Line. As of right now, we're gonna do Madeline and Butter Gloss. This might change after I actually put my dress and stuff on. Okay, let's get this off. Check them lines of demarcation. I'm gonna have to tie it back down though because I'm sweating, you know? Ooh, so cute. But this is the one we got off Amazon today. It just arrived overnight. It says Wavy Talk. It's really skinny. Um, I think it's three eighths, I think was the size of it. It curls pretty nicely and it's skinnier than the one I had before. So look at this, I'm so mad about this. And I don't wanna put too much heat on it since it's already fried, you know? We are gonna do our little curlies here. And I am in desperate need of washing my hair. I'm gonna do that tomorrow because I think tomorrow I'm gonna go out and have um, brunch with baby girl after this crazy week because she's been very disheartened as well um, and then i think i'm gonna come home and have myself a little self-care day which includes washing of the hair oh so cute so clearly i can't talk while i'm doing my hair but this is the style this is what we're going with i'm gonna spray it i've been spraying with gossipy and i'm about to wash my hair anyway so i'm not so concerned about it getting hard with the gossipy and then i'll spray with the design essential spray to keep it nice and shiny. And then I'm about to go and sit under the fan because <laughs> I need to cool my body off. I'm gonna wash up a little bit after I'm cooled down and then we're going to get dressed so we can get out of here. All right y'all, so here's the dress we decided to get. It's hard to really see it, <laughs> but it's like a one shoulder, one sleeve type of dress. I did try it on when I first got it and I was like, yeah. I didn't want a repeat of last week um, when I needed to go to the store and get <laughs> boob tape. So I was like, let me try it. I tried it on yesterday just so I can know if I'm good or not. And we're good. We're gonna have to skip most of the putting on the dress because uh, we may get under here, but yeah. <laughs> so we got it on, I just zip it up in the back. It comes around like this. And it's a little tight on the arms, but it's super cute. <sighs> I struggled getting this up. I might have to have a mirror come in here and help me with you. Like last Sunday. But we're gonna get it up. But this is the dress. Isn't this cute? I wish it was longer. Actually, no. I guess because this is formal, it's like, okay, I wish I had a little bit more length. But it's a, it's a bandage dress. So I feel like I wouldn't be able to walk. Right, I'm just pulling it down a little bit. I'm gonna zip it all the way up. I'm gonna have a mirror clamp me when she's done out the shower. I feel like with the bandage material, it holds us in, so I don't necessarily need any type of strapping up. Um, but yeah, I love this dress. I think it's so cute, especially with the short hair, which I will see in a minute, baby. It's giving. So the question now is jewelry. I thought about, I'll turn my phone off because we don't need that for this. Um, I thought about these. I got these from Zara and it has a matching bracelet, but part of me doesn't want to do these, but they are pretty. I feel like they do lend themselves to like the fall vibe. And here's the, here's the bracelet. I don't know if I want to put the bracelet on the arm. Oh, this is cute. I'm gonna ask Amira's opinion. She be knowing, you know what I'm saying? But I like this. Even if we put this over here, no, I feel like it gives more. We can put like some basic, like, basic like gold over there. I like this one, the sleeve, you know? This definitely gives fall. Yeah, yeah, I love it. I wanted to go darker with my accessories, but I was thinking about either this, this gold bag from um, Shein. I was gonna wear this with some gold shoes. That would have hit so hard. But I do have these like Steve Madden nude shoes. I'm gonna try some different options real quick and we're gonna figure that out. But first let's go in with a fragrance. I did re-up on my signature fragrance, which is Eilish by Billie Eilish, but it's giving black owned tonight. <laughs> so I'm gonna go into NDA by Forever Mood because I love this fragrance and my girl Jackie owns this brand. So 
I don't think there's anything else we need to do. Let me try some options and then I'll get back up with you guys downstairs so we can see the full vibe. The jewelry decided to go with and the um, accessories too, because right now I'm a little, a little indecisive. All right, y'all, decisions have been made. I think the hair looks great with the outfit. Kind of want to separate these a little bit. Sometimes I like when it's like separated and it's like feathered. I don't know, we'll fix it in the car. I just told Amira that she's my uh, stylist <laughs> and my assistant. She helped me put a safety pin here to connect these two. Um, I can't really lift up too much because right afterwards, to your work. I went to like curl my hair. Why is she screaming? It's me talking, I told you. She doesn't like to let me have conversations. I went to curl my hair and it popped, so Amira helped me to reinforce that. But yeah, y'all, we decided to go ahead and stick with this jewelry. I think it fits perfectly with the fall theme and the dress. We're wearing this gold she in purse. It's a little cheap, which was one of the reasons why I wanted to get to the store today. And Amira was like, when she saw all my options for my, um, for my accessories, she was like, if this is the case, I would've got up and made us get up because it needs gold shoes. I know it does. It needs it, but it's okay. I think we're still fine. We decided on the gold bag instead of the um, black YSL that I always wear with these shoes, uh, just because I feel like the gold looks great with the jewelry. So yeah, girl, these are the rings that we're wearing. Um, uh, this one is from Flair & Co. And then everything else is from H&M, except this one is from Lovisa. So that's the jewelry. This, these earrings, and this is from Zara. The dress obviously is Fashion Nova, Tom Ford shoes, and Shein bag. It's about a 42, 43 minute drive. So we're about to go ahead and get up out of here. What's annoying too is this bag keeps closing. I mean, not closing, this bag keeps breaking. Like the chain keeps coming off, which is crazy to me. Oh no. Good luck to me picking that up. Cause child, this dress is real tight. Am I ready to enforce uh, the liner? Um, yeah, I decided to go ahead and stick with this um, lip combo. I love it, it works. See, look, this just popped right off. I just can't really understand why that keeps happening though. Cause it seems strong enough to stay, but I can't even take my mirror with me because, um, oh, my be careful. I can't take my mirror with me because it won't close if it's in there. So anyway, girl, I feel really cute in this. Um, I feel like this is formal enough. <laughs> So yeah, let's go have some fun for the day. Yeah, 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 yeah. Bad little flex, she wanna know me. I stay low key, all gas, no breaks, baby. Let them hoes sleep. Body on ten, make your girl OD. I get in my way, never out of my lane. Feel like you the one in the more one. So what is gonna be? Baby squad up, we finna go deep. You never lie to me Keep the moves on tuck I know it's all up Everything good Keep the vibes on crush I know it's all good Know it's all We got a whole bunch of stuff. <laughs> so I'm about to show this to y'all real quick before I go and take my makeup and everything off. Y'all, I'm about to lose a tire and I'm so mad about it. I hit a really bad pothole um, before I hit the highway. And yeah, right as I was about to get off the highway, because I thought we was doing pretty good. My light came on and it started going down quickly. I had to stop at night to go and fill up, fill up the tire just so I can at least get home. 
and it's like flattening out in the garage. I just looked at it, it's like, <laughs> I could feel it. I could feel it since I put the air in it. Like I can feel it getting, you know, more flat. But anyway, child, had a great time tonight. It's fine. <laughs> We're home. That's all that matters. And I told y'all tomorrow, I'm trying to have like a very chill self-care day. I have all my groceries I can cook and just mind my business. So we'll be fine. I will handle it on Monday period. So they were doing engraved um, makeup brushes. So I got mine. I just put Maya on mine. It's so cute. Okay, let's see what else is in here. Okay, so we got some nails by Paranova. We got some ooh, pattern leave-in conditioner. Love that for me. I will be using that tomorrow. We got some hair clips. I ain't got no hair, so I'm just gonna pop this into the bag. <laughs> what I use for Amira's hair. 30 Roses Hydrating Rose Water. I don't know what this is, but I'm about to open it. This was the cutest event, y'all. I'm so, I'm so proud of Tisha, man. She has really grown that brand like crazy. It's one of my favorite brands. Oh, this is so cute. Is this what it looks like? Oh, prep your skin for serums and moisturizers with this. Set your skincare by locking in moisture with this and refresh your skin and melt your makeup with this as well. I was hoping they was gonna have some Lorve uh, shades in here. So let's see which ones these are. I didn't get to go and speak to Diera, but she looked amazing. I've never had a pair of these, so let's see which ones we got. Oh, and they're pink, period. I've been wearing a lot more color lately, so we can, we can do this. <laughs> these are the ones we got. Oh, Amir, look at these, aren't these cute? Oh, that's cute. Those are so cute. Okay, so we got those. We're gonna have to put a really cute outfit together to wear those, for <laughs> sure. It's not my usual, but I feel like I can definitely rock those. Danessa Myrick's palette, period. Yeah, they were one of the sponsors as well. This is the Lightwork Volume 5 palette. I knew it was some good stuff in here. This is a very heavy bag. Gorgeous. Oh, that's so pretty. There's so much stuff in here. There's a bag in here. Protect your piece and your edges, sis. Uh, well capped. This is cute. We got something from Grande Lashes. We got this package from Grande. I used to use Grande all the time. Their lash serum from Well Capped. Dry shampoo. This is from Amika. Apple cider vinegar scap and hair rinse from Rizzo's Curls. So many things. Um, TGIN Honey Miracle Hair Mask. I'm trying to get better about even when I get like PR or stuff like this. I've been doing so much better about just getting into it immediately because when I don't, things just sit around and I don't get to it and it's a waste. So this is You To The People Superfood Cleanser. Oh, it's a face wash. Oh, this is cute. I might try this tonight because I have no makeup wipes, so. <laughs> Um, we got styling cream from Pattern 2. So we got the leave-in conditioner and the styling cream. Strawberry Matcha Latte Eye Patches from ESW Beauty. We got 54 Thrones Hand and Body Butter. Hi, Diobe. Hi, baby. Uh, we have a Travel Lash Curler. I'll probably give this to Amira. Um, we got the LYS Glow Cream Glow Blush Stick. I'm pretty sure I have this one though, so I'm gonna go ahead and um, gift that one. Starflower Serum, what is this? Okay, Bloom Effects Tulip Screen Hydrating Lip Oil. We got a Black Girl Sunscreen Sample, Ellis Brooklyn Dear Sky. Oh yes, a fragrance, love that. Love me a good travel fragrance. And what else we got, what else we got, what else we got? Like, this is a really great the package. Um, gift. This is the facial radiance pads. And what else we got? Brown Girl Jane Carousel Perfume. Supercharged Moodux. Moodux. This is a um, perfume as well. So I'm so tired, y'all. So more than likely, I'm about to load up the content from this and uh, go to bed. And then I'm going to get up at five and get this video edited and up for you guys for tomorrow. Uh, so good for a friend. Shout out to LYS for inviting me tonight. I had a great time. And thank you guys for watching this week's vloggy vlog. And I'm gonna see y'all next week. Bye, girl. All the games that you play, all the love you've forsaken, you let it slip away. Oh, 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 oh. You don't care what to do to me. Every single
step back every mishap. 